Okay, let's estimate a concrete slab. All right, so let's say that we're going to put in this curved driveway. We have to figure out how thick we want to, or how much concrete it's going to take to pour this concrete driveway. So um, we're going to make this driveway, uh, let's say, five inches thick. We'll give it, we'll say, five inches. Um, we're going to probably use a you know, 4,000 pound or 4,000 psi concrete. So, to figure this curved driveway out, what we're going to do is we're going to find the area of the whole circle and subtract the inner circle to figure out what it is. All right. So, area of a circle is pi r squared. So. What, is, what does this mean? Pi is a given, so pi equals 3.14, and R stands for the radius. The radius is the distance from the exact center to the outside edge. Okay, so the numbers that we have, then, we, then H, or T, let's go with a T. So then the T equals the thickness. All right? So we got pi r squared times the thickness. So our equation then would be pi, the radius is 20 plus 14, which is 34 squared plus five inches thick, so that would be five over 12 feet. And then we have to divide by 27 because 27 cubic feet equals one cubic yard. So in your calculator, you would hit pi times 34x to the 2 times 5 divided by 12 equals, then I have to divide by 27 and hit equals again. So, where's pi on this thing? I have pi times 34 squared times parentheses 5 divided by 12 parentheses equals divided by 27 equals and I get 56 cubic yards. So if I did the whole circle it would be 56 cubic yards, okay? But I only want half of the circle. So then I'm going to divide this number by 2. So 56 divided by 2 equals 28 cubic yards. Okay? So now I'm going to, I got the whole circle. Now I'm going to find out what this inner circle is. So it would be pi, this time it's 20 squared, times 5 over 12, divided by 27. So you have pi times 20 x to the 2, times parentheses 5 divided by 12, equals divided by 27 equals. So pi times 20 squared times parentheses 5 divided by 12 parentheses equals divided by 27 equals. I have 19.39 then we have to divide that by 2, 
because we only want half, and that's 9.7 cubic yards. So the inner circle, would, or this half of the circle, would take 9.7 cubic yards. The whole circle would take 28 cubic yards. So then all I have to do is take 28 minus 9.7. And this is 3, and that's 17, so 18.3 cubic yards. So it would take 18.3 cubic yards to pour this driveway 5 inches thick. And then I add 1.1, which is 10% for waste, 18.3 times 1.1 gives me 20.13 cubic yards. So if you didn't think you were going to waste a lot, you could round that down to 20. If you thought you were going to waste more, you could round it up. If you're your concrete company says, oh, we can do half yards, maybe go up to 20 and a half, or maybe you have to go up to 21 because you think you're going to mess up a lot or whatever, but it would take 20.13 cubic yards of concrete to pour that driveway.